closer to Christmas. Um, a little time to play here. I thought we should just go ahead and resume wherever we were. Uh, do I remember exactly where we were? No. But that's okay. We'll get there. I know I was doing something the last... Excuse me, the last time we were playing? Yeah, where am I? Whoa, got some hot coffee there. Just scald in my mouth. Of course, that's better than cold coffee. Anyway, um, let's see. So we got a barrel. Oh, looks good. Where am I? Mm, does this give me the map? I am in the Blooming Rose. That's right, I gotta go see somebody in the Blooming Rose. I don't remember what it's about. As you can tell, I'm kind of taking the long way around. I'm checking out all the rooms. I'm not in a rush. I run by all the people. I don't know what the hanging sacks are. Or those hanging... Well, anyway, whatever they are. I don't know what those are. Let's see, can we go this way? Oh, it looks like we can cheat. Oh, okay. We can't go through here. I think I've been here before. Hey, that's Sabina's brat. Oh, good for you, dude. Okay, so... I think I came in that way. And so I've been wandering around. What's back here? Oh, looky here. These things look kind of scary. I don't know what they're supposed to be. But kind of scary. Let's see if there's anything back here. Some people looking all serious. Alright, well, I don't see anything sparkly for me to interact with or pick up. Pardon me. I'll get your order in a minute. Come on, get my order now. I don't think I can do that. Not going to happen. Oh, come on, dude. Here, I made a rogue and I made him work up his skill. Just for him to tell me he can't open a simple door. Oh. Alright. Oh. So this is who we're meeting? Today's my rest day, but I'll make an exception for you. What can I say? Why work if you're not working hard? Jathan, have you seen Nanette lately? Nanette? Not for several weeks, which is a shame. I enjoy her company. I hear she finally left her worthless husband. Good for her. I just wish she'd said goodbye. Did she tell you she left her husband? No, I just hope that's what she did. Ghislaine only wants her for her family's wealth. Nanette's a jewel. Elegant, worldly, just the perfect level of depraved. Ghislain doesn't deserve her. Hmm, I'm not sure either of these people are that nice. Ghislaine knew about you and Ninette. Did he talk to you? The man is incapable of talking. He came here, yelled at me, called me a dirty knife ear, among other things, and accused me of corrupting his wife. We had him thrown out. Do you think Nanette has come to harm? I hope not. Everyone loves Nanette. Sometimes twice a night. <laughs> Ghislaine's the only one who might hurt her. And he doesn't have the balls for it. Okay. Wow. Um, not very helpful. Do you have any idea where she might be? Well, uh, there was someone else looking for Nanette. Oh, here we go. A Templar. I believe his name was Emmerich. He wouldn't sleep with me either. I can't see why a Templar would be interested in anyone who isn't a mage. Okay, this is weird, but okay. Any chance Nanette's an apostate? 
Well, she certainly cast a spell on me. <laughs> anyway, if Nanette was a mage, I think Emmerich would have said so. Okay, couldn't we just kill him and be done with it? That would be nice. Perhaps Emmerich knows something we don't. Emmerich said he'd continue his investigation in Darktown. You could see if he's still there. And if you find Nanette, tell her to drop by and see me sometime. Okay, I really don't like this guy much. No, wait, what's this? He has a quest? Back again. Sure you're not interested in my many, many services? I was just passing through. Have it your way. Okay, I'm really scared of this. But we're going to do this. Hold on. If this has some awful adverse effect, though, I want to be able to reload my game. <sighs> Back again. Sure you're not interested in my many, many services? I was just passing through. I just have to think so. Have it Hold your on. way. I wonder if he will talk to... Back again. Sure you're not interested oh. in my many, many services. Let's see what happens. I have coin in my purse and time to spare. Why not? Make us breath. Can't you do this when I'm not around? Run along and play, Bethany. This is not why we came to Kirkwall. Okay. Okay, we'll just we'll just bypass this. Yeah, that's all right. I'm going to reload my game. So that's all that was about was... Was... Uh, you know, and this is an older game. This is not a new game, and I am still, like... So it was what I thought it was, which disgusting and I really did not want to have anything to do with that but okay whatever okay dude you can just stay there we're, we're moving on uh, all right so let's go and do I thought it would open up a new quest it is a quest marker why is she in her underwear that just looks weird this is not I didn't think this was that type of game but now I'm starting to wonder Anyway, um, Dark Town, I think they said, right? So I've got to head to Dark Town. I have my coffee. I'm trying to stay awake, really, seriously. I'm always tired. It's terrible. It's terrible. All right, so let's see. Um, I think there's something else to do here as well. So maybe we'll do that first. It looks like I have to circle around. Oh, no, wait. Wrong way. Oh my goodness, I am a doofus. I was not following my map very well, sorry. Alright, so we need to head down this way somewhere. Haven't I read this already? We'll just make sure I read it. Oh, I guess I hadn't. Huh. Maybe I'll read on my wife's playthrough and just forgot. me. Hmm. Also, do we need to go to the Chantry for something? What for, I wonder? The remains of Sister Plinth. <laughs> well, you'll pardon me. We're just going to check it out. I probably should have saved. Because if this does something I don't want to do, like, moves my story forward une unexpectedly. Oh. Can I explore? No. Oh, look at that. Commandments of the Maker.
Okay. I wasn't overly impressed, but it was okay. A ladder and a chain. The first of Laker's children watched across the veil and grew jealous of the light. Blessed art thou who exists in the sight of the Maker. Much? Sing of the chance so that it may be. No, that can't be right. All right. Um. Ruby is a good boy. Here we go. It's pretty long. I'm not reading all this. I'm sorry. I, I don't have the patience to really sit and read all that. I would doze off anyway. Honestly, I am always just five seconds from just dozing off. Maker's blessing, oh. child. I am Elthina. Grand Cleric of Kirkwall, and I believe you're new to our city. It was a near thing what happened in Ferelden, but in the end, the Maker stepped in. I hear a lot about the Knight Commander here. What can you tell me? Let's, let's Gossip be nosy. Is a sin, child? Knight Commander Meredith has an admirable devotion to her duties. To the exclusion of all else. Okay. It is not my role to form opinions on her character. Oh, well, okay. okay Why let's... are circle mages here kept in a Tevinter prison? Ah, so soon you take an interest in our problems. The short answer is it was a building, a large one. Should it have sat empty? The Chantry found a use for what was once a horror. It is the nature of men to move on and forget the past. Even your blight will be a distant memory in our lifetimes. Okay. Can I get your benediction? May the Maker bless and keep you. May his smile grace all the days of your life, and his light guide you to his side. So let it be. So let it be. Well, I guess that was nice. In its own way. The maker... You know, I have a feeling if this was the whole book, there would be a lot more to this. Okay. Let's see. I was coming up here for a purpose. Hold it. Let's read. Let's read his book. This might have worldly knowledge that we need that I can ignore and get into more trouble. Can we open this door? I guess that's a no. But we can talk to him. Did you misplace this? Bless my fool spirit! I never thought I'd see that again. Thank you. Yeah. Well, I guess you're welcome. So that's all I had to do here. Okay, well let's move on then. We have, uh, uh ugh, I can't talk. We have other things to accomplish. Alright, let's take off from here. Where were we going? That was the thing. Something about Darktown, wasn't it? First sacrifice, do we... Is it at night? Or does it matter? Hmm.
So let's go to Darktown. We'll just go. Rather than me sitting here trying to figure it out, we'll just go. Alright, so we're here in Dark Town and we're moving along. Going down the long road. How far do we have to go? A long way. It's okay. Let's see. Back this way. And back this way. Oh, here's the meeting place. Oh, for Eldons are not. Sorry. Okay, let's just click on the meeting place and get it done, right? Oh, it's taking us somewhere. I didn't realize that. <clears throat> hmm. So are we upstairs? I guess we're upstairs. Hmm, interesting. Uh oh. Yes, you can perish, dude. Just perish. Is there not anybody else left? Oh, there we go. Oh, there's somebody behind us. Oh my goodness, they're all around us. I did not realize this. I thank you, Sirrah, for coming along when you did. I am Emmerich. Just the person I was looking for. I need to speak with you about Ninette. Ah. Gislaine yes. de Don't mind the blood covering my face. Me. I tried looking into it. However, the investigation has been a waste of time. Oh, well, why has it been a waste of time? You learn nothing. Most people just say she left her husband. This all started when Meren, one of our circle mages, disappeared. I found it odd. She was a bit older and hardly adventurous. Then I heard about Ninette and two other missing women. And you have doubts that they merely fled? I think the disappearances are connected, and I suspect foul play is involved. Hmm. Let's ask the People pertinent don't just question. Disappear. Perhaps they were murdered or kidnapped. We found no bodies, no ransom notes. Those women just vanished. Hmm. Have you mentioned any of this to the city guard? They say there's no proof the disappearances are connected. They think the women just left home. That it happens all the time. People don't just disappear. Perhaps they were murdered or kidnapped. We found no bodies, no ransom notes. Those women just vanished. Hmm. Let's go. Can with I this. assist your investigation? It's no longer my investigation, Sirrah. You may take over if you wish. 
This battle showed that I'm no longer the warrior I used to be. I know when to walk away. Here, take my findings. Perhaps you can make more use of them. I'm going back to the gallows. I'm too old for this. <laughs> I'm too old for this. Foundry in Lowtown. I should look into that. Oh, something in Lowtown. Oh, he's getting too old for dealing with all these thugs. I wonder if there's anything to find here, though. I've not been here before, I don't think. Pile of bones. We found some piles of bones. Or a pile of bones. Can we open this door? Oh, it'll be a quest some other time. If the deep roads is what you want, you have the coin to do it. Well, I guess I just have to leave then, because there really isn't anything else for me to do. I know. Oh. Hmm. Pardon me. <clears throat> what was I saying? Yeah, there's nothing else to do here. We might as well go. So, let's head back to Darktown, and I will move on. I'll try to drink my coffee and wake up better. Just call. I just just change my channel and be the sleeping gamer or the sleepy gamer, something like that. Anyway, um, all right. So let's see. I really need to just get out of here, don't I? Um, that's a dead end. Do I want to go that way? It's just a dead end. That chest is not sparkling for me, so nope. I don't want to go that way. Let's go this way. Let's see if we can find our way out of here. La, 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 la. I don't know about you, but every now and then, the old Yellow Submarine song Take just pops into my head. Oh, this is the guy with the poisons and stuff, right? Yeah, poisons. I don't really. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. I'm so sorry. Low Town? Do we need to be low town at night? Oh, I guess we do need it to be low town at night. Okay, let's go low town at night. We'll get some bad guys, we'll get to kill them. That'll be good for us. Yes, there's somebody to go go talk to and oh here's Samson again what is that weird noise oh I have to go into the dark foundry the dark foundry it's so dark we will not be able to see. Oh, well, it's not that dark. Oh, looks like there's some possible bad guys here. Oh, I would say we have trouble. But that's okay, we kind of wanted trouble, didn't we? That's the whole idea of the game, in my opinion. Oh, look. Oh, we got some really bad guys here. Oh, my goodness. A Desire Demon? Okay, I've not seen the Desire Demon before. I'm not sure I'm that interested. I don't have a big desire for the Desire Demon. I do need to kill them. Shoot, dude. Shoot. 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 Good job, dude. You killed the Desire Demon. I think that's much better. What's up here? Oh, y'all are hitting down there. Oh, okay. Now you're heading back up here. Well, I tell you what, let's just... I'm not out of energy yet, let's just keep going. Not out of 
health yet. Everybody's health looks pretty good. But kill him, dude. Sometimes my guy just stops and doesn't do anything. What do you think that means? Um, shades? I think shades mean something bad. I think desire demons mean something bad. I think it's all bad. It's all bad all the time. Got the ugly bad dudes, like little demony guys. Anytime you have demon people, it's not good. Sack of bones. Oh. Oh. Nanette. Well. You can survive without a hand. This doesn't mean anyone's dead. A severed hand, a ring, and a pile of bones. Emmerich will want to see this, and I should bring the ring to Gisle. I'm sorry, I have to say that she is probably dead. Used. Wait, didn't we? Ah! Ah! <laughs> they startled me. That was funny. Oh, that was pretty good. I have to admit, nothing like being startled in your game. The demon startled me. Oh, I think I stepped in something. That's terrible. <clears throat> yes, um, yes. Well, maybe they scared something out of me, and maybe that's what she stepped in. I did not know, but it was funny. They startled me. <clears throat> well, okay. I thought it would be fun to explore this whole area. I think we're done now. Got all the little demony shade people we're gonna get. All right, let's see, where do I need to go? I guess I need to go see the Emmerich guy, the Templar, and the guy who was looking for Nanette, or had us looking for Nanette. Nanette, not, not anything else. Where's the stairs? The stairs are right in front of me, and I could not see them. It was too easy, too obvious. It's always hard for me to see the obvious. It's much easier to find something. When it's not obvious, I'm probably taking the long way around to get to where I can get out of here. But this is the way I came in, so it's okay. Oh, here we go. Alright, so... Okay, so we can go to the gallows. Was that where that guy was? Excuse me. Sorry. Well, I guess that's it. Let's go there. Okay. The gallows. 
seems appropriately named appropriately named if you look at that oh here's Emmerich you might want to see this this was left in the foundry you mentioned in your notes I was also attacked by shades these are human bones then there is no chance of finding Meren alive or any of the others oh I saw someone leaving the scene but they got away I'm sorry it was more than I accomplished my people have been slow to react but this needs official support I will bring this to the city guard immediately it should be enough to convince them the disappearances are worth investigating <coughs> pardon me <clears throat> pardon me didn't want to make too much racket didn't want to cough on the mic I'm bad enough as it is if I fall asleep I'll snore who knows what will happen it'll be terrible who do we want to talk to is it the dude in the middle it looks like it's the dude in the middle Wow, this is a challenge to get the little speaky thing on him. There Do we go. Do you know a recruit named Karen? His sister is looking for him. We cannot speak to you, Messer. Oh, good. We'll just be leaving then. To go somewhere that isn't the gallows. To the void with that. Karen and the others are missing. But our orders... The knights aren't doing anything to them. Maybe it's time to ask for outside help. Why must you keep silent about Karen? You obviously aren't a Templar, Messer. No. No Templars in this family. A Knight Lieutenant gives you an order, and you obey, without question. They told us not to breathe a word about Karen and the others. They must have their reasons. And that'll be a great comfort if you go missing next. I wasn't even certain Karen was missing. Who else is gone? The first ones disappeared weeks ago. There's been at least half a dozen. Wilmer and Karen were the most recent. You can trust me. I'm only trying to keep Karen safe. I hear that Knight Commander Meredith has some new initiation you have to go through. If you're not strong enough, or fervent enough in belief, you don't make it out alive. Her own people? That's horrible. And you honestly believe that? Recruits keep going missing. Wilmot came back. What? He did. I saw him this morning. If Wilmot came back, he might know more about the other missing recruits. I bet he would. Wilmot told me he was going outside Kirkwall. Clear his head. He said. Why didn't you tell us this? Knight Captain Cullen ordered it, right before he chased after Wilmot. That wasn't too long ago. If you hurry, you may catch them on the road. Catch them on the road. Okay. If I hurry, if I can keep from falling asleep, right? We'll do the best we can. Hold on a second. Oh, that's just my people following me. Very well. Let's roll. All right, so what do we have left? We have Wayward Son, which I will do. Not sure I want to do that right now. We have Fool's Rush in. So here we have a couple of things to do out there. Maybe we should go do those before I do any of this stuff in town.
Okay, um... Sorry about that, terribly sorry. I just totally dozed right off. That was really sad. Um, tell you what, let's go to High Town and see what this is with Fool's Rush in. Well, is that a part of the main quest, though? Or should we just go out here and take care of this business? Oh, let's go take care of this business. Yeah. Horribly sorry. I just, wow. That's how it's been lately. I've got to do something to wake myself up and do better. Let's see, so it looks like the camp is off to this side. Not sure if that means I should go the other way just to be different or not, but let's go this way. We'll take the direct route. All a pile of bones. Poor Will Maud, I barely knew ya. I guess that should be a last poor Will Maud. Well, this is the same way we could have just come in this way to begin with. Oh! Poor Will Maud. hear the, the creepy music. They're trying to scare me. Don't scare me. Don't give me the creepy music. I don't want it. Well, let's explore this little area. Oh, another corpse. Alright. Ooh, the Templar recruit Wilmod. And someone else. Alright, let's go. Let's do a quick save in case I do something dumb. Or in case I fall asleep and get us trouble that way. Who knows? Trust they be my witness, Wilmot. I will have the truth from you now. Mercy, oh. sir. Mercy. Were it that easy. Don't hit me. Al? Did he just knee him going, in the and I will know now. groin? That was not nice. Don't you lay another hand on that boy. It's the night captain. Don't. This is Templar business, stranger. <laughs> you have struck me the last time, you pathetic human. To me! Oh. Oh. Well, okay, maybe he needed to be struck in the groin. Yeah. This looks a bit worrisome. Well, Lord, I'm sorry, dude, but you're just going to have to take some punishment like everybody else. The abominations have got to die. Oh, we've got more abominations. Oh, and abominations behind me. This is not nice. Dude, cut it out. Yes, Robin, you can shoot him. Oh, now we have a rage demon. How interesting. I knew. I knew he was involved in something sinister. Well, you were right. But this... Is it even possible? Do you think he was possessed? Normally, we only worry that mages will fall victim to possession. I have heard of blood mages or demons in solid form who could summon others into unwilling hosts. I had not thought one of our own would be susceptible. You shouldn't have been out here alone with him. I am Knight Captain Cullen. I thank you for your assistance. I have been conducting an investigation of some of our recruits who have gone missing. Wilmot was the first to return. I had hoped to confront him quietly, out of sight. I see. Let's you ask the pertinent question. While he was gone? Obviously more than I had anticipated. Obviously. Wilmot has never been fully convinced of the Order's rules. Majors cannot be our friends. They must always be watched. I thought Wilmot might be meeting with some old friends who'd escaped the Circle. 
Do we want to have that discussion with him? I've got friends who are mages. Are you saying they need to always be watched as well? I was at the Circle Tower in Ferelden during the Blight. I saw firsthand how Templars' trust and leniency can be rewarded. I still have nightmares of Aldred's depravities. Well... The recruits believed that Meredith was conducting some sort of deadly ritual. What? <laughs> That's preposterous! Recruits can be worse than a weaving circle with their rumors. There is a vigil before Templars take their arms, but the gravest danger they face is falling asleep. I was trying to find another recruit, a friend of Wilmard's. Do you know where Karen is? He also disappeared. They were last seen together at the Blooming Rose. But I had no luck interrogating the, uh, young ladies there. I doubt they know anything of magic or demons. Oh. I'll speak with them. You never know how much you can learn from pillow talk. The order would truly be in your debt if you helped us with this. No one at the brothel will speak with me for fear I would shut them down for serving our recruits. If you learn what manner of creature did this to Wilmot, please come tell me in the gallows. I will ensure you are rewarded. Interesting, okay. Wilmot, the Rage Demon, the Abomination, the Abomination, they all had stuff. Alrighty, um, anything up here? No. So, I can either leave or go back and leave, so I guess I might as well leave here. Didn't we just go to the Bloomin' Rose earlier? I thought we were just at the Bloomin' Rose. While we're out here, let's go see the abandoned ruins and see what we can do here. I don't know what kind of trouble we're going to get into here. But it's probably not going to be good. It usually isn't. Well. Well, I'm not immediately attacked. That's a good sign. As good as my, the signs ever get, anyway. I've been sent for the man you've cornered here in the ruins. Ah, so you're the reinforcements the magistrate promised. The man you're looking for, he's holed up in the ruins. Though I doubt he's still in one piece. That bastard's to be brought in alive after all he's done? Just because it isn't you and your pretty little Shemlin children he's after. Please, calm down and tell me what happened. The man you're after, he targets elves! He dragged my daughter into those ruins and killed her! I want him dead! My girl, Leah, uh, she wasn't his first victim. Over the years, he's taken dozens of our children, and not once has he paid for his crimes. Um, well, why is he taking children? Would you mind telling me who you are? Uh, my name is Elrin. I'm a merchant in the city. Please, no one else cares that our children are being slaughtered like beasts. Why only elves? Why not human children as well? We're easy prey. No one thinks twice when an elven child disappears. There must be some humans who would take offense to these disappearances. Right, somebody should. To them. Even if this murderer does finally go before the courts, the magistrate won't take our word over his. Hmm. I'll tear his throat out myself. Thank you, Sarah. You have no idea what this means. You couldn't turn to the guards. For all my damn coin, I'm still only an elf to these Shemlin. 
There'll be no justice for my girl in the courts of Kirkwall. This murderer cannot be allowed to walk free. Then that bastard will finally get what he deserves. Thank you. Not wise, stranger. You try to take justice into your own hands. The magistrate will have your head. Only if it's reported. I must do what is right. Hmm. Interesting. I'm not sure if that's really what I wanted, but since we're here and we've started it, let's just go. I mean, what was my other choices? I don't know. But it sounds like if he's been killing a bunch of people, of course, I am just taking one dude's word for that. But let's just ride with it for now. Let's just go and... Oh, no. I don't want to leave. I was just checking. It doesn't look like there was stuff behind me. I don't remember this place. Spiders. We don't like spiders. Under any circumstances. The spiders are not. Even teeny tiny spiders. I do not like them. Spiders are never good. Never, never, never. This looks like one of those things. That's a trap! Ha <laughs> ha! He scared me. Oh, that was so funny. Again, I am such a doof. Oh, my goodness, more spiders? What's everybody doing? Let's get back to the door and help out people. Oh, well this was not that bright of an idea, I guess. I thought this would be more helpful. spider. Did I get this, the gland I needed? I think I did. So I think I got all the alchemist stuff. Alright, you know, I could just go there. Wouldn't it be more entertaining to explore around? Seems like it would be. Though there might be more spiders that scare me. <laughs> you never know. Hmm, maybe not. Okay, I'm not going in there yet. Let's go back here. Ah! Well, I was right. More spiders. Blast them all. doing though I didn't see that anybody was oh more spiders okay that was unexpected in my opinion you know just for me okay well did I walk right by that pile of bones I guess I did should we go in this way let's see what's in here you know this is just going to be more trouble. There's going to be a bunch more spiders, ain't there? Ah! Worse than spiders. Spiders and skeletons. You know what? I keep. I know he wants to come out and play. I hit the wrong thing. Well, 
Why do I have it? Oh. Okay, now I'm really. Oh no, I let somebody die. Oh, that was too bad. I should have done better than that. Yeah, I know. I'll have to give her a thing. Let me treat her injury. I know. She's injured. Luckily, I have injury kids. She'll be better. There we go. Nobody else died, did they? Looked like it was just her. Kind of my mistake there. Letting her die like that. I was not paying enough attention to everybody's health. Nope. We will take all the the moolah we can get, I guess. Oh, I can't go through that door? How interesting. And we go through this door. See, I thought this door was a choice earlier. And I walked past it. Who are you? Oh. Please, can you get me out of here? I just want to go home. Don't be afraid, Dalen. Everything's going to be all right now. Leah, your father told us you were dead. Yeah, really. My father? Is he safe? Kelder said that he'd hurt my family if I didn't come with him. Who is Kelder? The man who took me. I don't see any injuries. Are you all right? He hit me, told me I was nothing. I begged him to stop hurting me. I didn't think he would, but out of nowhere, he pushed me away and just started crying. Don't you see? He didn't mean to hurt me. He told me. There are demons. They make him do these horrible things. What kind of demons? What did they look like? I don't know what they look like. I didn't actually see any of them. But Kelder told me to run, to get away so they couldn't make him hurt me anymore. Please don't kill him. It's not his fault. Please. Kelder is dangerous, Leah. If he fights back, I can't promise he won't get hurt. He won't fight you, I promise. Run to the entrance. You'll find your father there. Hmm. Well, that was a change of events. So, is this not where we came in at? Oh, I can't go back this way, I thought. Okay, well, how interesting. Okay, so we're going to go on this way, then. Oh, the game is saving. Okay, this usually means something bad. So, I'm going to do my own save as well. What's your step? Oh. Why are we getting all these skeletons? Well, I guess it says corpse. Is there that much difference, really? Skeleton. I think it's the... Why is she always saying that? Oh. She is, she is weird. Alright, so let's do another save here. Yeah, sometimes I can oversave, but let's just do this. In case I want to make a different decision for some reason. I knew my father would eventually send someone. I was hoping beasts down here would get to me first. You wanted those creatures to kill you. Why? It's what I deserve. I should be torn apart, forgotten down here, not protected by my father. The magistrate sent me. 
I've never even met your father. He didn't tell you, did he? The Magistrate is my father. He's tried so hard to keep me... and what I've done... hidden away. I'm disgusted by the both of them. The Magistrate is supposed to protect the people of the city, and that includes the Elves. Father is a good man. He tried to help to stop me. But he can't. No one can. That elf girl, she had no right to be so beautiful, so perfect. The demon said she needed to be taught a lesson, like all the others. The circle was supposed to help me, but they lied. They said there were no demons, that I was mad. This isn't my fault. Hmm. Let me get this straight. You torture and murder elven children for being too beautiful. I... I didn't want to hurt them. They forced me. The demons don't like it when they cry. Leah said you told her to run. Why? I was... crying, and she asked me if I was all right. After everything the demons made me do to her, she was concerned about me. How could I let them destroy something so good, so pure? It's obvious that you're not well. You need help. No, I'm not mad. It's the demons. I can't stop. I've tried so many times. Please, you have to kill me. There's no other way. Just tell my father I'm sorry. For everything. Hmm. Let the court sort this out. It may end the same way, eventually. No! I don't want to hurt anyone else. I'd rather die. Uh. Nobody liked that decision? Well, I may have to reload and undo that. Both of them got mad at me. I, I don't understand why, really. But let's go see what's going on in here. Should we have let him die? Where is he? Oh. Hmm. I don't understand. Am I misunderstanding? I think I am misunderstanding. Hold on a second. We can reload to here. Let me make a save. I'm curious to see what the difference is. Let's make a save here. Now I'm going to load the game before I made my decision. What if we just went ahead and killed him? Okay, we're just going to go in and this time we're just going to kill him. We're just going to be kill him, be done with him, and see how that goes. This is kind of a confusing... I'm just curious to see. It could be that nobody will like my decision no matter what I do. I 
I knew my father would eventually send someone. I was hoping the beasts down here would get to me first. You wanted we'll still talk to, to kill you. Why? It's what I deserve. I should be torn apart, forgotten down here, not protected by my father. The magistrate sent me. I've never even met your father. He didn't tell you, did he? The magistrate is my father. He's tried so hard to keep me and what I've done hidden away. I'm disgusted by the both of them. The magistrate is supposed to protect the people of the city, and that includes the elves. Father is a good man. He tried to help to stop me, but he can't. No one can. That elf girl, she had no right to be so beautiful, so perfect. The demon said she needed to be taught a lesson, like all the others. The circle was supposed to help me, but they lied. They said there were no demons, that I was mad. This isn't my fault. Let me get this straight. You torture and murder elven children for being too beautiful. I... I didn't want to hurt them. They forced me. The demons don't like it when they cry. This really sounds like he's crazy. Leah said you told her to run. Why? I was... crying, and she asked me if I was all right. After everything the demons made me do to her. She was concerned about me. How could I let them destroy something so good? So pure? It's obvious that you're not well. You need help. No, I'm not mad. It's the demons. I can't stop. I've tried so many times. Please, you have to kill me. There's no other way. Just tell my father I'm sorry. For everything. If nothing short of killing you will stop this, then so be it. Goodbye, Kelda. Some people are simply broken. Okay. Oh! Everybody liked that. And there's the exit. Okay. Uh. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna ride that answer out. I'm not sure that I'm totally sold on that being the best answer, but... Very well. I don't know what kind of trouble this will give me, but let's just go with that then. Let's see how these people react. You saved her. My little girl. I didn't dare hope. Did you find that monster? Is he dead? He won't harm Leah or anyone else ever again. I didn't believe an elf could ever get justice in Kirkwall. I speak for all of us when I say that we are in your debt, Sora. Oh, she's not happy with us. I feel just as bad for those knife ears as the next man. But ignoring the magistrate's direct orders, that's madness. Uh, see, we might be in trouble here. I don't know. It's hard to say, isn't it? Is there any reason to go back in there? No, I don't think so. I guess we should leave. Um, should we go see the magistrate? Ooh, this does not sound like a promising idea, does it? Let's go to see what we need to do at night in Hightown. Oh, actually, I need to take a break for a few minutes. Now that I'm finally waking up, sorry about that. Uh, I know there a little while earlier I was like dozing off badly, but that's, for whatever reason, that's what's going on with me lately. 
anyway, um, actually I'm not going to save because I want to wait and see how the Magistrate treats us. Um, yeah, we'll live with it. It'll be fine. Anyway, um, thanks for watching and I will catch you later because I, I will try to be back in a little bit.